Hey guys, it's John Kinswater here with Concert Addiction. Today we're going to be talking about um, one of the original members, I believe so anyways. One of the original members of rap rock group uh, Hollywood Undead has announced that they're leaving the group. Uh, this actually comes from a press release from Hollywood Undead that uh, Matty uh, Curls, I believe is his name. Oh, Matty Duck Curls, sorry. Uh, one of the original members has decided partway. This is their percussionist, also works on vocals and stuff like that for the group. Uh, the band released a statement last night, October 10th. I'll go ahead and read that to you right now. They just stated, Maddie and Hollywood Undead have decided that we are parting ways amicably. Maddie decided that he would like to pursue his own interests, and we are supportive of that. We wish him nothing but the best moving forward. And uh, this statement comes long overdue. There's been speculations for months uh, about what happened because I guess they've been out on the road and he hasn't been with them but they never made an official statement on whether or not he'd left the band right now they're saying that it was kind of a mutual kind of decision there's no hard feelings kind of thing he left because he wanted to do his own thing but I find that hard to believe the fact that they kept it quiet for so long maybe they're trying to get him to stick around he's not sticking around he's moving on to his own thing we haven't fully uh, learned what that is yet but I'm sure it's gonna be great because uh, he's a big contributor to Hollywood Undead. He's made, he's uh, had a part in their first uh, four albums, I think, they're at now. Um, they've got another album coming out just in a couple weeks, so it'll be interesting to see uh, whether or not he appears on that album or not. I assume he would because the split seems to be kind of a relatively new thing, but the details are still kind of fuzzy at this point. We don't really know. But like I said, uh, we've kind of been waiting for a statement for a while now, and... And this is what we got, so I guess we got to run with that for the time being. More details may come out, and if they do, I'll make sure to post that on the Facebook page or make another video if it warrants it. But yeah, for the time being, that's uh, that's the news for today. Really, it came out last night. Matty Da Curls, I, I think I'm saying that right. I don't know. He is no longer with Hollywood Undead, so it's it's a pretty big deal. One of uh, they're not. They've kind of tampered off the last couple of years. I've still seen them on a couple of festivals where they're playing lower. They're not quite headlining anymore. They're they're lower on the lineup and things like that. But I remember uh, when I was in high school five, six years ago, uh, sophomore, junior year, Hollywood Undead was just like the biggest thing. And a big part of that, you know, I, the credit is distributed equally between all of them. They're all musical talents. And uh, so it sucks to see them go, but I'm excited to see what... Uh, what's going to come next from him. So, uh, that's my thoughts on that. Next time there's something to talk about, I'll be here talking about it. Uh, make sure to like the Facebook page, facebook.com slash concertaddiction, as well as check out the website, concertaddiction.com. Never miss anything on all the, the news uh, about concerts and tours and festivals, anything related to that stuff we're kind of talking about. I uh, also do recaps or reviews, which I haven't gotten around to doing on the YouTube channel yet, but there's a couple written up on the website uh, for all the shows that I go to, or most of them I try to anyways. Also make sure to subscribe to this uh, channel, youtube.com slash concert addiction. Go ahead and give this video a like. And then also in the description I'm going to have a link once again to the GoFundMe page set up to help the victims of the Las Vegas shooting. Uh, we're still reeling from that, as I keep saying in all these other videos. It's not going away. Um, it's still something that we have to deal with, and the, the, the GoFundMe page has crossed like $10 million, I think. They're, we're, we're doing really good helping raise money for that, and uh, but that's that's a drop in the bucket. You know, these, these people are going to need all the help they can get, so we continue to try to help, try to do our part to help them with that. So, uh, until next time, I'm John Kinswater. Uh, thanks. Bye.